Hi everyone, Dave here. Um, just doing a brief video. Um, got a couple of things in mind that I'd like to, to share with you guys and whatnot. Uh, first of all, uh, I'd like to give a shout out to Multimax123456. Um, he's a first year trapper here in Newfoundland, Labrador. And um, he's got some great videos on his channel. You guys should check him out. Um, He's uh, he's a very nice guy. Uh, comments on a lot of videos and everyone out there that's out enjoying the outdoors and whatnot. He's uh, he's uh, well involved with uh, with wanting to learn and sharing advice and those sorts of things. So uh, he's got a, a contest uh, right now to try and get some more subscribers and views for his channel. And uh, I think he's giving away I think a dozen uh, five sixty four cable. Uh, Fox snares, coyote snares, and as well, uh, I guess he plays on a local band as well. He's a musician, and uh, so he's giving away a CD as well. So, uh, everyone out there, check out his channel, Multimax One Two Three Four Five Six. Like I say, a very great guy, and uh, should uh, you guys should check him out. What I what I wanted to show you guys, uh, this is a book here. Um, where I live, I live on Red Indian Lake. Uh, here in central Newfoundland, it's I think the third largest lake uh, in Newfoundland on the rock, and uh, the lake has got a lot of uh, you know a lot of history um, behind uh, with you know heritage and, and uh, there was a, a native tribe uh, back in the 1700s uh, right up until I think the 1800s, uh, the Beothics. Um they were called the Red Oak Indians. Um, the Othix were uh, unfortunately uh, terminated, um, killed off, um, like I say, a, a century and a half ago or so, and very sad uh, uh, the outcome of, of losing a, you know, a, an Aboriginal group uh, such as the Othic that lived off the land, um, right in my backyard where I live here. Uh, so an author that's been doing a lot of research, he's got a lot of great books out, uh, John Kitchen. He's, uh, he's got a cabin, a summer cabin, he spends time um, maybe a few weeks every year, no more than 200 feet away from me, right outside my, my picture window here. Uh, he's a great author, got some great novels and stuff out there, and um, shows a lot of history with Newfoundland and Labrador and, and right across Canada. So the, one of his latest uh, books is uh, the, the Newfoundland Biothic, and it's uh, basically Termination of a Tribe. Um, my belief, I don't know if this is correct or not, don't, you know, uh, don't get me wrong, but I believe it was, <laughs> my opinion of it all is that it was a human genocide. Um, probably the only known human genocide in, in North America throughout the years. Uh, back in the 1700s and 1800s, uh, European settlers came to Newfoundland exploring and, and those sorts of things. And uh, throughout the years, they were... Um, I guess uh, threatened by the Beothic uh, in, in regards to they didn't know who they were um, they were they were frightened by them it wasn't that the Beothics were uh, were aggressive or, or anything of that nature but anyway this book is very interesting I'm I'm uh, I'm reading it now and what I thought I'd do um, because like I say it's it's a part of history uh, not only Newfoundland history and, and native history but uh, history in, in North America and worldwide, but what I thought I'd do when I finished reading the novel, if anybody's interested, uh, I think William Larkin Jr. and a few other people out there uh, that I'm friends with, there are a couple of books uh, that are in circulation right now and we're sharing to, to anyone that's interested in, in, in reading and, um, and, you know, wanting to share. So what I thought I'd do after I finished reading this, Anybody that's interested in uh, in in reading this, because um, like I said, it's an awesome uh, awesome book. Uh, just uh, send me a PM, and I'll um, I'll, uh, I'll I'll randomly choose who who you know who I can send it to. And what I'd like to do is is get it sent out, um, sign the back of the book. I've already got my name signed here. Sign it. Pass it along to the next. Uh, person that's interested in reading the, the book and eventually uh, after it goes throughout circulation I'd like to probably try and get the book back uh, for for memory's sake and for keepsake for 
share them with YouTube friends and whatnot. So anybody that's interested, send me a PM. Um, and in a week or two's time, uh, I'll, I'll send it out to somebody. And uh, once they finish reading it, they can send it on to the next. Like I say, it's a great read. Anybody who enjoys um, reading about history and whatnot, this is this is a great book. Um, majority of it is all um, is is all factual, um, and there are some hypotheses, some ideas of what happened with certain stories and whatnot throughout the book that are uh, that are not uh, factual, but very interesting reads. So anybody that's interested, let me know. Uh, send me a PM. And I'll, uh, I'll gladly uh, send it off and hopefully we can get this book uh, sent out to anybody that's interested in reading about uh, history, uh, Native history in particular, whatever else, uh, you know, it's a great read. So anybody that's interested, send me a PM. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll send it off and hopefully we can get it out to as many readers as we can uh, throughout uh, our, our friendship here on YouTube. And it um, be nice to get it back once it's, uh, once it's gone through its... Uh, circulation and uh, but anyway thought I'd share it with you guys um, I haven't been doing a whole lot lately um, the weather has been crazy it's been really cold we've been going through an arc blast of uh, super cold uh, temperatures and uh, so it's been sunny some days but we've got a lot of high winds and whatnot so um, I've got no beaver traps out no nothing uh, everything else is done with the trapping so Hopefully uh, this month and in April I'll get out and uh, get some, some ice fishing videos and whatnot. So uh, anyways guys, thanks for watching. Uh, like I say, send me a PM if you're interested in, uh, in reading this book. Uh, and again, check out Multimax123456 channel. It's got some good stuff out there. So anyways guys, thanks for watching. Enjoy the great outdoors.